All right, Dave here with another exciting tutorial. And today I wanted to talk about how you can share either your iPad or your iPhone. Um, this works on Android devices as well. Um, so you can see here that I have my iPad on one screen here. Um, I also have my phone on the other. And when I flip through, you can see that I can um, do that. I could also, you know, kind of go into an app here and if I'm working on a project, I can, um, you know, I could work with that. Let's say I'm working with a tutor or something along those lines and I wanted to kind of share that back and forth. Let's talk about how to make this possible, okay? It's actually really simple um, if you know a few quick tricks. So the first thing, the first trick is to go to mirroring360.com and this is the software uh, that you need to download. You need to download it to your computer and you can see that it works with iOS, Android, Chrome uh, books, Windows, and um, Mac books. Um, and so you basically you can kind of share anything, okay? And it's gonna be wirelessly. You don't have to plug your stuff into the computer. It's pretty cool. Um, and if I click on buy now, I can choose which license I have, okay? Or, or which license I want. And they'll give you a, I believe like a, um, a week free trial um, so you can try it out see see if it works for what you need it for um, but then if you like it then you can think about purchasing it but I feel like really reasonable um, it's a one-time purchase so you can see that it's normally $15 um, you know for a standard license 50 for a business and then for education and corporate I mean you'd have to contact them and then you can kind of see here uh, what happens so if you're once again if you're an individual user uh, this is the one you could be looking at and you could just go ahead and click on buy now and then it'll um, you know take you to credit card information you put that stuff in and then you go ahead and download the app um, okay now let's say you have the app okay now what so if I come here um, I'm just gonna go ahead and close these up okay so if I launch it um, if I launch the app, so I could go here and I type in mirroring 360 and launch it, it looks like this, okay? And it's basically saying, hey, it's ready to connect any device that, that you're sending and you can name your computer. So I just named mine MSI, uh, this M MSI computer. I feel like I know that that's what it is, okay? So now how do we connect? Well, I'm gonna go ahead and connect I know this sounds kind of weird. I'm going to connect my device and then show you how to connect. So here's my iPad and it's actually really simple. Um, the only thing I'm going to do, so pretend I have an iPad. It's not connected to the computer at all. I'm just going to swipe down from the upper right hand corner in this area. I'm just going to do a diagonal swipe down where the time is. So if I swipe down, this shows up here and then I can click on the screen mirroring area and I'm gonna select MSI because that's what I named my computer okay you can see that I can also project it to the living room or the home theater or whatever or my TV but if I select MSI now it should connect and I should be able to see it on my computer okay um, and if I take an iPhone or my phone I'm gonna do the same thing I'm just gonna to go to the screen mirroring and I'm gonna choose MSI now I don't need both of these to be shown okay you can see that I'm once again swipe down from the corner the upper right hand corner and then I just went here to um, the mirroring and if I ever want to stop the mirroring I could go to that same area and I could just hit stop mirroring okay um, so now what you could do is you could use things like Google Hangouts to share this screen with let's say a tutor or somebody else because right now you've wirelessly projected your iPad to the computer but now you would need to use something like Google Hangouts to do that and if that's something that you're interested in um, and most likely you would want to because why would you just want to project it to your computer um, so I've got a video and I'm gonna put a link at the um, in the description and show you how to do screen sharing. But this is just a video on how to get your iPad or iPhone, um, your mobile device 
projected wirelessly to your computer. And whatever you do on here, it's just gonna show. So that's pretty cool. So if you have any questions, go ahead and leave them in the comments below. Um, and if you found this helpful, uh, make sure that you subscribe to my channel for more kind of tips and tricks uh, in the future. All right, thank you.